Hello everyone. Welcome back. Hope you all are doing great. Guys, today I have a very interesting scenario based question for you. Let's test your networking skill, networking knowledge. And this is my scenario. As you can see in my scenario, there are three switches, switch one, two, and three. And I have one user on all the switches. I have one user in VLAN 10 on switch one, user in VLAN 20 on switch number two, user in VLAN 30 on switch number three. Link between switches are configured as trunk and VTP is running. All the switches are in VTP domain and VTP pruning is also enabled. So if VTP pruning is enabled, then switch one should not prune VLAN 20 and 30 on this trunk link on 0 slash 0 link, right? Switch two should not prune VLAN 10 on this trunk link and VLAN 30 on this trunk link. Similarly, switch number three should not prune VLAN 20 and VLAN 10 on this trunk link. But you know what is the issue? Switch 1 has pruned VLAN 30 and even switch 2 has pruned VLAN 30 on this port. Let me show you here in the output. Let me take you to switch 1 and here if I will run command show interface trunk you can see on 0 slash 0, 0 slash 0 link is configured as trunk, no problem. All the VLANs are allowed, VLAN 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. All the VLANs are allowed, but you can see not pruned VLAN list is here, VLAN 1 and 20. Only these two VLANs are not pruned, means VLAN 30 is pruned over here, correct? But will switch number 1 should not prune this VLAN, VLAN 30 on the trunk link what can be the reason behind it and let me show you some more detail here on switch number two if I will show you the output so interface trunk you can see switch two on zero slash zero link on zero slash zero link VLAN 10 and VLAN 1 are not pruned that is absolutely right correct but on zero slash one interface only VLAN 1 is not pruned means VLAN 30 is pruned what can be the reason and on switch number three on switch number three so interface trunk so interface trunk so interface trunk here you can see on switch number three all the VLANs are not pruned VLAN 10 20 30 40 50 but on switch number three only VLAN 20 10 and VLAN 1 should not pruned it means what switch number three will forward broadcast message of all the VLAN from this link right but here we have user in VLAN 20 here I have user in VLAN 10 what can be the reason what can be the issue and you know this this switch is configured as transparent mode switch so VTP status so VTP status here you can see mode is transparent switch number three and these two switches are server mode switch you know transparent mode switch will not generate any VTP message if it will not generate any VTP message, then how it will send the join message? It will not send any join message. Switch 2 will never get to know about the pruned VLAN on this trunk link. So you should tell me in the comment section what can be the solution. First, if you want to practice set up it, you can design this lab in your EVNG and uh, you can configure the scenario. You can configure VTP domain name, link between switches as trunk and after that you can enable the VTB pruning then you can change the transparent mode right mode over here on switch number three you can set the transparent mode switch and you will have same output as it is output right and then tell me the answer how I can fix this issue right should I not configure transparent mode switch whenever I we are using the VTP this can be the m m solution but no right we can use the transparent mode switch as well so what can be the solution for it hope the scenario is clear and if you are the paid student guys right if you have already completed ccna and ccnp or any course from us right you must share answer in the comment section because in the classes we have checked seen these kinds of scenarios and if you are the subscriber not learned any NNP till now, right? Or maybe you have learned in past 
but still lacking and planning to learn master ccn and ccnp course then i am starting a new batch from the upcoming monday right so from 18th of this month so if you are interested then you should check the detailed information right and you can register yourself if you want to learn and master the enterprise network ccn and ccnp but those is sec those are secondary thing first tell me the answer of this question in the comment section i will check your answer that's all for today after your answer in the comment section again i will make one more video on it this is just to test your networking knowledge that's it nothing else bye bye guys